today we're going to be looking at a rather unusual Jimmy item. This is a modern tabletop. This was made for either 2019 or 2018. I'd have to check everything again to see, but it's one of those two years. And it is a Chinese Santa. And I'm not saying that because he looks Chinese, you know, he obviously doesn't. But if you look at the sign he's holding, you know, it's in Chinese and the music he plays is in Chinese. And I was really surprised to come across this item, you know, especially in the United States. You know, I would have never expected to see it. You know, this is the kind of thing you would see, um, you know, like some Chinese company copying Jimmy with, or, you know, you would maybe you would have seen Jimmy make it way back in the day. But nowadays, you don't typically see many items that Jimmy makes that are, you know, for a Chinese, you know, customer. You know, you don't really see that as much. Most of the customers they work with are in the United States, Canada, and Mexico, and the UK. You know, so it's not often that you see things that are, you know, kind of tailored to another culture or region outside of that. So this was a pretty shocking find. I, of course, had to pick it up. Um, and it is a prototype. There's a little, you know, like a lot of the modern prototypes have, there's a little piece of tape on the foot with the item number written on it. There's no other kinds of labels, though. Um, but I had certainly never seen this before. Now, I believe there was one made of this Santa with the sign, and it would say, like, Santa, stop here, or something on it, and it played an English song. But this one obviously plays Chinese. And what's really interesting is I actually had a foreign friend of mine translate the sign and the song for me, and they actually don't match, apparently. And this could be wrong, but I'm 90% sure it's correct. So, one of the... so. The song and the stop sign have to do with different occasions. So the, one of them has to do with, you know, New Year, like maybe the Chinese New Year or just the actual New Year. And the other one has to do with Christmas. So they actually don't really correlate, which I found really surprising. You know, you would assume that the sign and the audio would match, but apparently they don't, which is really interesting. Um, so I'll give you a close-up look here. So there's the sign. If anyone can read Chinese, then, you know, you're welcome to obviously translate this in the comments. I was told what it said, but that was a while ago. That was like about a year ago now, actually. So I don't really remember exactly what it said, but, you know, you've got the song and you've got that and they don't exactly correlate. You can see the button is kind of just hand stitched on there. And it's got that typical look for a modern Jimmy Santa plush. And I don't typically, you know, purchase these kinds of items, you know, like the modern plush, because they're not really, you know, they they seem, you know, kind of over-the-top kid-friendly, you know. It's not something that could be, like, necessarily as enjoyed by, you know, people of all ages. It's just, it's also just the modern style. And, you know, there's nothing wrong with that. It's just, you know, different than what I prefer. Um, but obviously a kid isn't really going to care, you know, if they're especially younger. Um, so I don't have many pieces like this in my collection, but it was so unusual that I figured why not I'll pick it up. And if one of you really desperately wants this thing, I might sell it to you. Just comment down below. But, you know, it's not something I'm really going out of my way to do right now. But I don't really have anything else to say about it, so without further ado, we will demonstrate him, and hopefully he won't fall over, but I feel like he will be doing a lot of that. So yeah, there he is. You can imagine my reaction when I first heard that audio. It's like, well, this is something special, you know, because, like I said, especially nowadays, you never really see stuff like this. And so it was really cool, and so that's why I picked it up. But that's all I have to say for this video. I hope you guys found this interesting or enjoyed it in some way, and thanks for watching.